These are lovable little lambs, but most of them are lucky to be alive at all, and some are barely surviving. Born a few days ago and rescued from the deep snow after their mothers died giving birth, now they're being hand-reared with a baby's bottle by farmer's wife Anne McHenry in the Glens of Antrim. Most of these are very weak because they've lost their mothers and we didn't find them until yesterday. So, you know, it'll take a few days for them even to get some strength up. Behind us here is Glenariff Mountain where the McHenrys had over 400 sheep grazing before the heavy snow struck last Friday. Now, they don't expect to find many of the animals still alive. The occasional sheep is still being found in the snowdrifts, but farmer James McHenry believes his livelihood may have been dealt a deadly blow. The situation's very, very bad here. I would just sum things up this morning and I would safely say that this is the end of my farming career. It's just finished virtually with a Friday, Saturday night storm. Why is it finished? We the losses are, are serious. As you can see here we've lost the sheds, the lambing sheds for the, the pregnant ewes that were lambing, a lot of baby lambs with nowhere to lamb sheep inside. We also lamb quite a lot of sheep outside. They started on Thursday. Now we haven't been able to access them, we haven't even been able to find them yet. A British Army helicopter has been brought in to airlift fodder and provisions to farmers like the McHenrys, who are now bracing themselves for more snow, expected later this week. Brendan Wright, RTE News, in the Glens of Antrim.